walked into the room and I thought about the years of service, uh, you truly define service excellence for uh, the tenure, for the years of, of giving up your hearts and your minds and uh, your hands and of course, I don't know how many miles you've walked over your years uh, service in our organization, but these places are big that we, we work in. So thank you very much for all of that uh, wonderful service. Um, I wanted to just take a moment and also recognize uh, Janice Reynolds, who opened up our time together. Uh, this is Janice's first attempt at putting one of these together, and I think she did a fantastic job. Well, we again welcome you to one of our most significant and inspiring events that we hold on an annual basis, and uh, that is truly to recognize our caregivers for their years of service, and it's pretty spectacular to think uh, on the number of years that we will recognize tonight. It's also a very powerful reminder of the legacy that we all share and that we all have contributed to make, as we know um, what the Peace Health heritage and the legacy is within our community. So our legacy uh, includes not only the inspirational and contributions of this ministry by our founding sisters of St. Joseph of Peace, but also the legacy represented by your combined 4,670 years wow. of service in this room. That's nearly 50 decades. <laughs> so the 184 caregivers that we recognize tonight in the year 2013 include uh, two 40-year caregivers, 14 with 35 years of service, 37 caregivers with 30 years of service, 69 with 25 years of service, and 61 caregivers with 20 years of service or more. So congratulations again. Um, when Linda Nelson and Carol Boyette, with 40 years of service each, joined Peace Health in 1973, Richard Nixon was president. <laughs> Unemployment was 4.9%. And a first class postage stamp cost 8 cents. <laughs> Roberta Flack won the Grammy for Record of the Year for the first time ever I saw your face. <laughs> I wish we had music in this. <laughs> I love the 70s. Didn't you know that? And um, interestingly enough, the first ever MRI machine was developed for the healthcare industry. So it's hard to believe how much has changed in the four decades since Linda and Carol joined the Peace Health family. And yet as we await still uncertain changes uh, that we know will come with healthcare reform initiatives at the state and of course federal levels, many of those being seen locally, we're reminded that our change process has always been a part of the Peace Health family. And yet, we've always tried to become better, smarter, safer, and stronger as a result of these changes. So we've succeeded as we often have, as we often have throughout the years, and it has been because of the caregivers like you in the room here tonight, men and women, who are compassionate and willing to stay with us, learn with us, teach us, and most importantly, teach the generation, the next generation of caregivers what it means to carry on the healing mission of Jesus Christ. So on behalf of the Peace Health system, our entire organization, the leadership team that joins you, I want to thank you and congratulate you on your magnific magnificent achievement and invaluable contribution to this organization. So here's to another 4,670 years. <laughs>